I'm Haktan Pekzelzu, and I suffer from obstructive sleep apnea. I display all its symptoms, interrupted breathing during sleep, daytime sleepiness, fatigue, and difficulty concentrating. I have most of these problems. For instance, it has a very negative effect on my social life. It causes issues in my professional life. I constantly feel drowsy, always wanting to sleep, but I never feel rested, even when I do sleep. My doctors recommended a CPAP machine. However, I couldn't use it. So, I sought a permanent surgical solution. After my research, I found Professor Fatma Tulin Kaihan. After consulting with her, she informed me that this condition can indeed be permanently treated and corrected with surgery. Professor Dr. Fatma Tulin Kaihan, an ENT and head and neck surgery specialist. I began my specialization in O2 laryngology in 1990 and obtained it in 1994. In 1996, I completed my scientific research as a research fellow in the ENT department of Harvard Medical School and the University of Minnesota. I received my associate professor title in 2004 and professor title in 2011. Robotic surgery is intensively used in two areas of ENT. One is head and neck cancers, and the other is sleep apnea surgery. The most common symptoms for sleep apnea patients are snoring, sleep-interrupted breathing, and daytime drowsiness. As the CPAP machine doesn't offer a permanent solution and can be difficult to adapt to, patients continue to seek treatment. I cater to all the needs of my international patients during their treatment process, such as travel, transportation, accommodation, and language support. Our dear patient, Haktan, and his family approached me with severe sleep apnea symptoms. He had breathing pauses in his sleep, excessive snoring, daytime drowsiness, which paralyzed his social life. In recent years, he also gained excessive weight due to his condition. I performed multi-level robotic sleep surgery on him. Our post-operative process was completed in seven days. We happily discharged him in good health. If you are suffering from symptoms like snoring, sleep-interrupted breathing, tiredness upon waking, or daytime drowsiness, my multi-level robotic sleep apnea surgery can permanently eliminate this condition from your life. Remember, obstructive sleep apnea is treatable. The latest development is the transoral surgeries I perform using the Da Vinci robotic surgery platform. The introduction of transoral robotic surgery brought significant advancements in sleep surgery. It's a very promising surgical method. Since 2009, I have successfully applied transoral robotic surgery to my sleep apnea patients. Achieving successful surgical results for sleep apnea patients requires the right patient, the right areas, and the right surgeries to be correctly performed. This is my primary approach to my sleep apnea patients. Patient selection, choosing the right surgery for the patient, and meticulously implementing the chosen surgical technique are paramount. With transoral robotic surgery, our post-operative process is very comfortable. Patients can immediately resume functions like eating, drinking, and speaking after surgery. Physician experience is crucial for successful outcomes in sleep apnea surgery. In sleep apnea surgery and robotic surgery, I am among the leading and most experienced physicians in the world. After undergoing robotic sleep apnea surgery, many things changed in my life. I now have more energy. My drowsiness is gone. I can breathe easily during my sleep. My attention disorder has definitely improved. My focus has increased. I'm very pleased. My life truly changed. I feel like I've been reborn. I genuinely feel like I've been given a new lease on life. I don't need to use the CPAP machine anymore. 
That's the greatest relief because it's challenging to use. You have to carry it with you constantly. When you stay somewhere while traveling, it becomes a massive obstacle. I had fears about the surgery. I thought it would be painful and difficult, but it wasn't like that at all. My surgery process went very smoothly. I'm very grateful to Professor Fatma Tulin Kaihan and the Megamed International team for their constant support throughout every stage.